I'm Jared Gilbert. I'm the owner of the Dapper Dan Barbershop in Bridgefield, Connecticut. So I started barbering in Rockland County, New York uh, for my fir former barber. Um, I apprenticed under him as well as went to school. I knew barbering was for me when I turned down the original job I was trying to get to continue my education in barbering and then pretty much woke up every day being happy to learn about something I was intrigued by. I decided to open my own shop after working for about um, 13 years, 12, 13 years in the industry. And I just had different views than the person I was working for. I decided to express my views by opening up my own shop, living the American dream and being closer to my family. I got the idea for the Dapper Den Barbershop while vacationing in Switzerland with my wife we were in Zurich and there was a nice gentleman style barbershop that I've never seen that style before so after seeing that I kind of came up with the idea of Switzerland gentleman style meets Williamsburg Brooklyn thrown up in Connecticut Dapper Den Barbershop opened their doors 2016. We're on our three year anniversary now. Um, I now have four barbers working underneath me. Within six months of opening the doors, I needed another barber. It was not easy to come by. Uh, a friend introduced me to, to George Romero, which is also a police officer in town, which me and him headlined the barber apprentice program in the state of Connecticut. He is the first graduate. And then after George working me, with me for a couple of months, I was introduced to Charles. Uh, he's been with us for a couple of years now. After Charles, a couple months down the line, we met James Zapp, which was actually a customer of the shop. So we gave him the opportunity to join on the team with the uh, apprenticing program that we're running. And a couple of, uh, maybe about a year later, another customer of the shop, TJ, jumped on board the apprentice program. The atmosphere in the shop consists of a lot of family things. I had my grandparents recently passed. I had my father recently passed and I inherited a bunch of things. It's not just um, you looking at a bunch of stuff to keep you occupied while you're getting your hair cut. It's also my family history as well as some of the barbers um, items as well to bring you into our lives. On any given day, we're playing different music anywhere from 20s to now. Movies, I like the 80s, I like horror movies. Um, I like that type of feel within the shop. I like to have the clients enjoy the music with us or actually find a song they like that they never knew about. Traditional barbershop would offer a drink, meaning liquor, beer, coffee, tea. We bring that back nowadays by gifting our alcohol. The Dapper Den means to me a traditional style barbershop where you're coming, you're getting a quality haircut for a decent price, a great atmosphere, 
where you can have fun, joke around, talk about what you want to talk about, and not be offended by the time you leave. Children are welcome at the Dapper Den. It is a an adult atmosphere. We do calm down when the children come around. I am a father myself. I like to give a decent atmosphere for everybody, but I think this would be more of an 18 and older crowd, but I just want people to know that when they do come in, it's not catering towards kids. If that's what you're looking for, there are other barber shops or salons that might give you that atmosphere. Within the next 10 years, I would like to separate the children from the adults within town and maybe franchise the two separate barber shops. My greatest accomplishment as a barber has been to do beard brand videos and be seen around the world by hundreds of thousands, maybe even millions of people and express my artistic view on the haircut. Another great accomplishment was to employ four college graduates as a high school dropout. To get an appointment at the Dapper Den, you could go on DapperDenBarbershop.com and it will have all availability of every individual barber and pricing. And we hope to see you in the shop soon.